Hello. My food is the best in all of Skyrim. Always as fresh as the day it was collected. Oh really? How do you keep this so fresh? I picked up a trick from a butcher in Elenir, a small town over the border in Hammerfell. He showed me a way to grind up ice wraith teeth and use it as a preservative. Keeps everything cold and fresh, but only for a limited time. I'm always looking to replenish my supply, so if you ever come across five of them, I'd be more than happy to take them off your hands. I'll try and find some for you if I, uh, if I manage to uh, come across any. Thanks. I was actually worried I'd run out. Realistically, it's probably going to take me a few weeks to uh, get them, so you might want to look into getting some immediately. Why does... Be uh... careful looking for those teeth. Those little bastards are oh, dangerous. so sad. Why does my uh, dialogue not, like, cancel itself? Whoops. Sorry. Um, so yeah, Alchemy Store. Alchemy Store and my staff is not appearing again. Why not? So Alchemy Store would sell all these portions and get my illusion torn back on my belt. Whoa. Aw, oh, man. Ah, look at the bundle. Oh, I will get you one day. Oh, there's no water walking portion on you, is there? I think it's water breathing. That would suck. You know I'd be making water walking. Wow, the water actually looks quite nice there with the reflections and stuff. Yoink. Let me grab you. I'm not collecting all these at all. <laughs> I mean, wow, there's loads down here. Um, we just done a bunch of alchemy. Uh, and I'm going to do vanilla alchemy next. Uh, wow, man. Alchemist better come to Rift on. Just something about my uh, um, experiments. Yeah. Uh. Uh. Right. Let's use. Oh no, I'm not using the alchemy lab. I'm my selling my. Oh, do I have a. Uh, stop making that noise. Uh, do I have a bath portion? Yes, I do. I have way too what many portions. Like even my personal stock is way too many. Drink up a dollar. Down the hatch. Okay, so let's uh Hello. This place has seen better days, but it's not my fault. Sorry to disrupt, disrupt you while you're eating, but uh I'd like to trade some stuff if you don't mind. So you're interested in my potions and ingredients? I'm actually hoping you'll be uh, interested in mine. Uh keeping these now. Uh, okay, let's uh let's do Let's do some trading, I think. Uh, again, uh, will I need to cut? Probably not. Doing this quite quickly here. Uh, so, yeah, the gold will mainly be used for um, mercenaries now. Because I need to start looking ahead um, to planning for um, the getting Grim's ever back. Ravage health. That they were not worth nothing but take them. Um, you know what? I'm getting rid of the slows. As far as I can tell, they do nothing. Uh, weakness to fire. Uh, I'll get rid of it. I haven't come across anything where I'll need, uh, I'll need that. So, fortify block. Magica is increased. Restores. That's a restore magica, but uh, I'll just get rid of it. Uh, and you are running out of money, which is not good. Uh, concentrated poison. Get rid of that. I want to get rid of all these. I don't need the... Um, I, I don't think I need to make my magica pool bigger. Uh, even when I'm running out of them, it's... Uh, I don't think I need to. Uh, same as that. Get rid of that. You are really running out of gold. Now I'm rich. Um, don't need sneak, even though I still... I don't need sneak right now, anyway. Uh, minor healing. Any... Wow, I have loads, man. I'm just getting rid of some of these restores. Um, it's a poison. Store stamina, I don't need them. Well, I actually could, uh, no, not with the drinking animation. I actually, I was going to say, I could actually use them for a, um, a, you know, dodging and stuff. Um, so, let's see what you got. You might have something really rare that, you know, no, 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 no. Don't forget us if you need supplies for your journey. I won't, thank you. Ran kind of like jerk what then. Was it you Nothing. No, I need uh, I need to keep money now for uh, yoink, for the uh, mercenaries and time to put my pouch back on. Have I got enough uh, back pass space? I do, but I'm low now. 
Uh, I, I guess I'll keep this pouch on me, though. I don't know how that works. Um, well, yeah, couldn't she stick stuff in the pouch then in her big backpack? <laughs> no, it doesn't make sense. Um, but yeah, I'll keep that pouch on me, actually. Right, so yeah, let's head to Crystal Drift. Let's get some action in. Uh, enough of the uh, mundane life of selling and alchemy. But we did get a ton of stuff. I really hope Crystal Drift ain't hard. Right, so let me get out here and I'll talk about what's going to happen when uh, stuff is too hard. Okay, so if I go into this Crystal Drift cave and uh, it becomes too difficult, I'm just going to leave and come back when I'm stronger. That's how Adala's going to tackle it. I'm not going to... Even though I said I'd cut out deaths, I'm not going to... Um, force my way through a dungeon if it's too difficult you know i think i'll limit myself to about three deaths uh i might do more if it, some of the deaths are really stupid and avoidable but uh yeah i'll give myself like three deaths and if it comes out, i'll just say adala's just not feeling good about this cave time to head out it is foggier than something that's really foggier so i need to get my candlelight out hopefully there's no bears i'm actually gonna quick save here i feel like i feel like a crash is coming Oh, drat, I had to die, man. That was a pretty fun. Why is my camera all the way out? What's going on? Okay, that was weird then. Yep, that sucked because I was doing really well then. I met a, I met a battle a battle brother, but I had to die. Yeah, I already know what we're dealing with you now, people, and this is going to be tough. Uh... This is going to be really tough. I, I really need to get rid of this fog. Uh, because it's uh, it's really uh, blocking my... Uh, actually, I'm getting you. I know you're a vanilla butterfly. And I want you. Yeah, we're dealing with trouble here now, people. Um, okay. Okay. Um, have I got all flesh activated? I don't. Uh, let's uh, kill you. I hate you. You wolves have been nothing but a pain in my butt. What's the point in calming you? That's how we go. See, I'm not even gonna... Not even gonna not going to uh, put them to use with their pelts. Um, this place is dangerous, man. The wildlife is bad. Um, yeah, I think it might be better without candlelight, actually. But I think I'm going to keep all flesh out. It really does help. Really, uh, really beautiful, though. What's here now? Two dead here. <gasps> ah! Friend, my battle brother, which no one has seen now because I had to cut it out. But yes, I will help you. Actually, I'm not calming nothing, man. I I'm in it for the kill. Spiders! I'll help you if I can get over this rock. Good job, sir. Good job. Um, yeah, I've leveled up. Level 10! I'm going to quick save you. Just in case I die. Um, thank you so much for the help of... You know, killing this thing. <laughs> I would not like to be here on my own. Uh, fighting these things. Um, okay, I don't like this. Because I know what's coming. Uh, a little bit of uh, role uh, roleplay immersion break in. But I know what's coming here. And this fog is not helping me. Adala would not... Oh! I can use my butterflies. Yeah! It's been a day. Let's turn them off. Where are they? Oh, they're not in my favourites because I used them. Ah, that's weird. I didn't know that could happen. Uh, oak, no, oak flesh I want to use. Keep forgetting about my butterflies. Right, so I know the cave's here. I'm worried about what's in front of it. So I'm just proceeding ahead slowly in this fog. I know it's there and I'm scared. Right, let's uh, let's get calm. Ready. Right I'm going in first person here. Uh, right. What's here though? Dala doesn't know. But I do, uh, a skiva? Why you guys weren't here? Listen, I didn't die to a skiva. Um, but I'm going to kill you, you filthy little things. If I can hit you, don't use my butterflies. Whoa! Can't even see them. Okay, they're dead. Uh, actually... I'm going to use a uh, magical regeneration potion here. Yeah. I need to. 
I think it was a mistake uh, installing that mod. <laughs> the uh, the trick of Porsche and it makes combat so much harder. Wait, wait, wait! I see you! I see you! And Adala doesn't know this, but there's another one somewhere. Where though? You know what? Um, I'm just gonna outright kill this thing. Uh, I I don't like to kill them in uh, uh, when they're calmed because it's mean. But these things are dangerous. So yeah, you gotta go. Sorry about that. Let's uh, let's skin you. Scoop out your eye. And take off your pelt. Right, um, Adala. Good luck, girl. Uh, this is gonna be rough. Uh, let's activate an oak flesh. Let's get calm. Well, we're not calm, we're scared, but let's, uh... I, I didn't need a quick save, but I will there. Let's head in. There's another thing out there! It better not come in. Something was out there then. I think it was another saber cart. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, nice little uh, harmonic howl there. Um, yeah, calm one, kill the other. I think. Oh, jeez, there's two. No! I got my butterflies. I'm safe. I'm safe. Life is good. Right, let's uh, let's kill this one. And I'm running out of uh, mad here. Might have to use my. I I need to keep one more butterfly for getting out here because I think there is a. Is someone set up here? Is there a person in here? Someone said... Oh, that's... Bi oh, no! That looks kind of... Ritualistic. Uh, I'll have to investigate now. Actually, that's the first thing a dollar would do. Sir! Are you okay? Yeah, this is definitely ritualistic. Ugh, disgusting. <gasps> okay, wait a minute. He might still be alive. <laughs> With all the blood around him. Uh, sir? Sorry. Um, let's see if there's a thing on you. Um, there's nothing. Let me read this book, though. Again, books on stuff is weird. Dala's reading through. Wow, so interesting. Uh, incredible. I actually really do want to read through these. I might do that. Um, again, Dala wouldn't take this guy's book, even though he's dead, though. My restoration scare goes up faster. Well, he's dead. I, I think I would take his uh, staff. Uh, I, again, his staff wasn't on his person in his inventory, so it's not like someone looted today was right here out in the open. So if someone wanted to take it, it'd be gone by now. So uh, let's check out this staff. It's the same one as mine, actually. Creatures and people up to level 4 will attack anything. That's good. That's really good. Uh, but the thing is, does it put up my magical pool? Uh, and how can I check? Let me use sparks. Let me use all flesh actually And let's equip that staff Oh it does <gasps> Yeah, yeah, that was good and as you can see here, uh, can you see the enchantment on the staff? It's kind of like a little all around top oh. oh My gosh, this was brilliant. I'm so happy. I came here I'm not fond of this cave though. And nothing to uh, indicate how this guy died. He must have fallen up there. Oh, maybe he got surrounded by the walls. Ah, I see. Maybe there's something around you though. What the heck? Carrots? Okay, so I know I've killed everything in here. So I'm going to start picking stuff. Um, I don't know what these butterflies are. I think the uh, colourful critters includes them. And I don't know what they're for. They're in like certain places. I do kind of want to collect them. But I don't think I will. Uh, not unless I know what they do anyway. Um, I don't have enough space to carry that. Uh, so I think I'll use my pouch space to collect um, ingredients. And there are quite a few interesting ones here. I do need... Um, I think I'll take some food. Uh, but I'm not in dire need of food. A peach dragon town. Ooh. Oh. Lady Kinnereth. Oh, wait, there's a letter here. 
Huh? Gadnor, my trusted friend and companion, has been laid to rest. I have built a shrine to watch over him and bring peace to it. We need to. I've been taking stuff from a shrine. Oh my gosh. No, wait, is that just from the. Oh, hold on a minute. Let's finish this uh, letter. Of the few riches Gadnor possessed in life, his most prized was a warhammer made of jagged crystal. He famously won in a coin toss. After months of research, he came to believe this hammer was some sort of otherworldly treasure. Shortly before his passing, it was his wish that I'd be hidden away until one who has, who has walked the shiv shivering isles emerges to retrieve it. I followed his instructions to the letter and a powerful illusion spell now obscures it. To break the spell one must first acquire pieces of what supposedly makes up, make up the weapon itself, amber and madness or such things if they actually exist would be great treasures if they own, in their own right. If the enchantments if the enchantment is correct only by placing the ore into the embers near Gardner's body will the spell be broken. If Gardner is not mad, perhaps one day this peerless weapon will find its way into worthy hands once again. Interesting. That's really interesting. So, um, I don't know if it's something that Adala will be doing. Because she's not interested in Warhammers. Uh, but yeah, that is really interesting. I'm going to assume the shrine is that there. Um, so I'm not going to take the stuff here. I took the portion. That, how was I to know? I didn't know. Um, but I'm not going to take anything else from there. Uh, wow, a lot of grilled leeks. I think I'll... Oh, would I eat them? They're off the floor. Damn it. Damn it. The role play is breaking apart, yeah? But I'll know. I'll take these uh, fungi, yeah? Um, and I would take his staff. Um, would I... Would I take his staff because his friend obviously laid him there? No, you know what? Uh, after reading that letter, um, get up there, please, Adala. You got strong legs, girl. What's going on? Uh, after reading that letter, Adala would know that it's wrong. As awesome as it is. Okay, Adala, you want to just throw? Adala's angry. Why should I give it back? Ugh. Yeah, pretend the uh, staff is right next to him again. Uh, Adala wouldn't take that. And I'm assuming this is where I have to burn the staff. Um, so, yeah. That sucks. We lost a good staff there, but it uh, doesn't matter. We'll get one one day. A good one. And I'm going to assume this is his staff that his friend just left. Like, you know what? Just leave it here. Uh, leave it untouched. Um, what's over here, actually? More fungi. And a little... Uh a little pool of water. So yeah, we've done what we needed to. Let's collect the uh, bounty. Um, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna skin these. Uh, take them. Uh, I'll sell them to uh, Balamand in uh, Riftan. Okay. Uh, little butterflies, please, uh, please protect me from whatever's out this uh, cave. Uh, activate no flesh. Uh, get that and calm right here. Uh, right. Uh, I don't need quick save because it'll save. No, you know what? I'll quick save you. Quick save you and uh, yeah, hope for the best. I can hear it growling. I can hear it growling. Okay, it's not coming after me. Let's just get back to Rift on. Find the path. It's gonna come behind me, isn't it? I know we will. Everything in this let's role play has been super sneaky. Okay, so that uh, that cave was a bit of a mess. Uh, a bit of a mess. I was steal stealing some stuff. I didn't know that was a shrine. And uh oh, is the orc more dead spiders? Is the orc uh, the orc killed them? Maybe it looks like he's moved on. I think. Can't see him around ya. Um, but yeah, we're in the safety of uh, a farm now. Taking you guys. You think I ain't doing alchemy? I'm doing alchemy. I'm doing vanilla alchemy next, but I'm, I'm doing you afterwards. <gasps> Scaly stuff. I can fortify my illusion. I, I'm trying to get the freaking butter player. Um, butter player. But the butterfly that's uh, on my screen. Like the one that's protecting me. I'm trying to collect that one. <laughs> uh. 
Hello. Let's get this one though. I think this is a vanilla one. No, it's not. Oh, that's a beautiful one. What was that? A feral? A feral? Actually, how much backpack space have I got? Quite a lot. I need to calm down when I speak, I think. Uh, I'm messing up my speech a lot. Speaking too quickly, I think. Um, but yeah, vanilla... 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 Alchemy is what we're doing next. And I'm pretty excited for it. Because again, when I know the effects of uh, vanilla ingredients, I can mix them with these ones then. And uh, brilliant portion shall be made. And money shall be earned. I've got a lot of coins now, all, but I think the going rate for the mercenary is around about 500 gold. So I want to get at least two two companions, two followers, uh, before I head to get Grim Sever. Don't want much more than that. Because uh, again, this dwarven uh, ruin almost killed me off. Me off. Me all. So, yeah, let's get the rift done. Okay, so we'll do some alchemy to end off the um, end off the episode, I think. No, the play session. Um, I'm not going to sell them. Let's do some vanilla alchemy right here. Um, I would, uh, yeah, let's... Adala's sitting here with her um, uh, feet on the steps. I would have hanged them off, but no. I'm worried the fish might bite me or something. Um, oh, and I do want to sleep, actually, to level up for the next part. So, yeah, let's get this vanilla crafting uh, done. Again, I do apologize if you like me looking at the book. But, uh, like I said, Adala thinks she should do it on her own rather than off the back of Cinderion, you know? Please let me do my alchemy. Why is it not working? Okay, good. Thought it wasn't working then. Uh, right, so let's do some um, vanilla stuff. Uh, oh, that was wrong. Okay. I have to be careful here. Um, damage stamina. Nice. Okay. Oh, wah, wah, wah. But uh, I still got... Oh, I forgot. Beivask is a... Uh, um, oh, I didn't mean to mix it with the freaking... Yeah, that's what I mean. I gotta be careful not to mix them with the... Uh... Wait, didn't I get all the... Okay, I think my uh, ingredients are resetting. You know I'm making that. Come on now, people. You know I have to. Uh... Resist fire and... Ooh, that's a, that's a nice little portion there, actually. Worth quite a bit. Uh, no, okay, I... Okay, I'm done with them for now. Uh, right, Elsius and I. I know the eye. I know the eye of a saber cart actually puts up stamina. I'll say a dollar remember it, remembers it from from the book. So uh, I'm not gonna just waste that. Fortify archery. That's a portion you can get. Um, but it's good though. It's really good. Get that money. Unfortunately, uh, the uh, apothecary doesn't have a lot of money now. <laughs> Need to get in your safe. Uh, fly Amanita. I'm going to keep garlic. I know that garlic does. Uh, garlic is part of the most expensive portion I can make. Honeycomb. Oh, that sucks. Let's do this instead. Nothing. Uh, vanilla alchemy, I feel, is a lot... Uh, because you don't get as many ingredients as this mod I've installed, I feel like uh, vanilla alchemy is a lot less forgiving. Uh, can I mix the... Um, can I mix the mud crab kite in with the eye of the uh, saber cart? I can. Nice, I'll just use them. Why not? Just get them out of the way. Um... I did just use that, didn't I? I'm sure I did, but I'll do it again. Regenerate health. Uh, stamina. Was it health? No, regenerate health. Uh, I'm not going to use the Nurn Root. It's too rare, I think. And I'm hoping I can actually um, uh, do kind of like do an exploit with the... Um, have I really not done... Oh, no, of course I haven't done that. With the uh, Nurn Root and that, when I get that, uh, I'll talk about it more now. Uh, I mean, I'll talk about it more in future episodes. I won't do it now uh, because I'll end up muddling up my words and stuff. Um, 
Small antlers also restores stamina, I think. I didn't know why I had them, though. Uh, but I thought I'd use them there. Uh, okay, that's it for there. That's a quite a good portion. Um, damn it, I have too many freaking... I have too many um, non-vanilla stuff. I'm keeping the scaly for the... I'm going to use salt rice and it damages stamina regen. Yeah, I think that's all the alchemy will do now. We've come to the end of the play session. I don't want to drag it on to like 1 hour and 20 minutes or something. So, uh, yeah, I do want to go to sleep, though. Eh, yeah, go to sleep, though. What's up with my speech? I need to drink a freaking speech portion or something for real life. Uh, let's head in now. Plus, I really want to end the session off. Uh, I don't want my capture card you know, breaking and losing all this progress. So, uh, I think I uh, got the rest of the uh, day for free. Yes, I do. Okay, so I think I'll sleep for an hour. Just to get this up, uh, I have no idea what I want to do in the future. Um, what am I doing now? I think start the next part, we'll do more alchemy because I got loads of ingredients to do. Um, I don't know what we're going to do. Because the apothecary has no money. Uh, I said I was going to do this next, didn't I? But that don't work. Okay, we can, um, no, okay, I'm not going to do illusion now. I, again, before we even start uh, Mazin Chalsef, whatever it's called, i got another four levels left until we can even plan on starting that. So I don't need to get that one. Ooh, another alchemy, maybe. Poisons, you mix a 1%. One, one 100%. 1% 1 more powerful per level of alchemy. So that my poisons are pretty much 46% more stronger there. Um, poisons you apply to a weapon last one additional hit per 10 levels of alchemy. So if I put that uh, <laughs> if I put that poison, that 1000 damage health poison on my iron dagger. Dude, I get like 4 5, four, five extra hits. Okay, we're working towards that, I think. Um, uh, your poison's highly corrosive. Okay, I think we'll do that. Uh, and again, that will um, that will give us more money as well. Because I assume the uh, poison will be stronger. Maybe if that's how it works. Uh, speech. What, what should I look forward to towards speech? Okay, that and then that, definitely. And then maybe I can start investing. Um, I don't know why. Uh, everyone is buying portions off me for five gold and then selling them for two thousand. So, uh, uh, what else does a dollar? Oh yeah, alteration. Uh, uh, wherever it's pointless looking towards the future for them. Um, let's eat something. Um, some grid leaks I found on the floor. Uh, I'll just say they were on the actual chair or something. I don't know. They looked healthy enough to eat anyway. So, uh, yeah, that is it for the play session. Um, in the uh, in the next part, we will uh, do some more alchemy, sell some money, and look at the notice board again. Maybe, maybe there's an. Oh yeah, I gotta give this bounty in. Oh, we'll do that in the next part. So, yep, that will be the plan, and I'll have to think of something else to do. So, thank you for watching. I hope you have enjoyed, and me and Adala Forestborn will see you in the next episode. Farewell.